Well, the painting's called Almanera, and um, the Almanera is actually a hotel in um, Tangier, in Morocco. William Burroughs and the Beat Generation stayed at this hotel, so this hotel, in a sense, had a kind of notoriety about it in, in the 1960s. And I actually made the painting for um, an exhibition of my uncle, who's Joe Wharton, who was also a 60s playwright and writer. And he also um, went on holiday in Tangier during the 1960s. I don't actually think that he actually met the Beats, but um, what interested me was just that period. And as a gay man, I was quite interested in the, these kind of figures from the 1960s. And it doesn't actually specifically relate to an actual depiction of the hotel itself. It was more like an idea and I wanted them to be in this kind of space which was fragmenting and so it's really about a kind of garden which is not, not you're not inside or not outside but you're in this kind of spatial zone and that interested me and then also what interested me about the painting about the idea of that time was um, artists like Joe Orton and um, William Burroughs are kind of championed for having quite kind of libertine values. But essentially, when they were, when they were working in the 1960s, living in Tangiers, you, you, you know, their attitudes were quite colonialist in terms of, you know, Western men, um, you know, going to Tangiers and kind of having relationships with you, you know, Moroccan Arab men and not really kind of caring about the consequences of their attitude. So I was quite interested in this kind of relationship between, you, 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 you know, between how these kind of Westerners could then go and work in, in, in Morocco. So giving it the title kind of specified it to that kind of that time and place. I don't actually ever kind of work from life. So the images that I get are kind of taken from the kind of mass media. And so I'm interested in kind of um, magazines, men's lifestyle magazines, because a lot of it is about what constitutes an ideal. And so, and I think that's why it was important to me that they were kind of unclothed and they have these kind of bodies and you don't actually kind of know their relationship between each other. But for me, this kind of, in my wider work, the idea about masculinities and what it means to be a kind of man is, you know, quite important. Painting has this really rich history and it's kind of really hard to kind of find your own way within painting. That's why, you know, and a lot of the time it's a really lonely game, so it's great to be in the prize amongst other painters and see such amazing paintings because they're kind of marker points really, which, you know, you need as a painter to sustain a career.